Eagle safety Malcolm Jenkins is leaning in on his message to push for changes on social justice issues. He published an op-ed presenting six objectives that he believes Philadelphia residents would like to see in a new police commissioner. Now his article is drawing fire from leaders at Philadelphia's police union who responded with strong words today. Action News' is reporter Christy Aletto live now at Philadelphia Police Headquarters with more. And Christy, this has a lot of people talking tonight. That's right, Char. The FOP attacked his ability as a baller and also said that his statements were slurs. And while police accountability has long been a rally cry here for residents, many of them tell us that that's not necessarily their immediate concern. Right now, they're more concerned with who is addressing the gun violence. A non-resident washed up football player. That's how FOP President John uh, McNesby do described no Eagles safety Malcolm Jenkins while responding to his op-ed this week. When penning a piece in the Inquirer about the type of police commissioner needed for the city, Jenkins touched on transparency, accountability, and someone who can stand up to the police union, saying whether through violence or racist Facebook postings, the police union is there to defend the bad behavior. We need a commissioner who isn't in lockstep with the union in that in that one section he talks about uh, us hiding uh, um, discipline and, and bad cops we don't do that we have no idea what investigation is going on until it hit after the police department's done with it McNesby says there's always room for improvement but feels Jenkins should fall back just wish he would stay out of it it does nothing to do with him Good job. Okay. Good. All right. But for residents and activists in South Philadelphia, their immediate concern is who is addressing the growing gun violence. As a community leader, when you see them going back and forth, it's like, look, like, like, <laughs> y'all going back and forth about that, but we're trying to keep kids safe on the streets. So the blood is not pooling on the ground. This as they learn to tie tourniquets for gunshot victims Tuesday night. What happened to women and children being off limits? You know, where is the... Um, Malcolm Jenkins, no disrespect, and everyone else that's not speaking out about that. The same behaviors were required for everybody across the line. If you In 2017, over, Jenkins did a ride along with Philadelphia police to better understand the day to day patrols. And just last month, led a town hall with Meek Mill on criminal justice reform and what residents want to see from the city's next top cop. So when you see someone, you know, speaking about that, of course, Malcolm Jenkins makes, makes a good point, but we need people to speak out on other issues as well. Now, clearly, Malcolm Jenkins has long been a champion for criminal justice reform and police accountability, among other issues. We did reach out to him, but he declined to comment this evening. Live here at police headquarters, Christy Aletto for Action News at 10 on PHL 17.